What if I tell you that in 2023, there are some new strategies using which your summarized written text in the PTE writing module can be solved instantly with four new techniques. Well, if you want to understand more about it, make sure you watch the short video till the end. Hey everybody, Nakul from Skills PT Academic. I'm back with at another video. Today's video is something really nice because I'm going to show you some new strategies using which there is a possibility of writing summarized written text in four different shortest um, ways possible. Uh, we will very soon unveil what they're all. Before we get into the video, if not subscribed to this channel, kindly click on the subscribe button and anytime you need online assistance, it's a paid assistance. You can WhatsApp us to the number given there. We will be there. I'll be there to help you, guide you in the right direction and to tell you a lot of students on an everyday basis are getting 79 plus in our course. Don't delay your success. Let me just straight away share my screen and get into the video summarized written text new strategies 2023. Well, today I'm unveiling four different strategies to write summarized written text. But before we get into the video, let's understand what summarized written text is and how it looks like. There would be a small paragraph, something like this, and there would be a box inside the box. You need to write cut, copy, paste, almost useless. But yes, you can try copy pasting and pasting it here. All those things may work. You have to write uh, between 5 to 75 words. I'll show the form, uh, the strategies in just a while. But yes, 10 minutes will be given. If you finish it in 4 minutes, can I carry forward this time? No, you cannot. So use the complete 10 minutes. What if the timer ran off? Will it be automatically saved? Yes, it will be automatically saved. The only one constraint here is to write in one sentence. Means there should be only one full stop. Grammatically, the sentence should be correct. Very simple module. Um, the length should be 5 to 75 words on an I, you know, average, I would suggest 45 to 50 words is ideal. Don't extend more than 55, 60 and all. Uh, the more you write, the more mistakes you make. 45 to 50, 55 is more than enough. Don't exceed. Don't write 70 and all. Not required. Summarized in text, one or two questions will come. But these days, two questions are coming on an average and contributes marks towards your reading and writing because you need to read and then write. So it contributes some four or five marks to reading and four or five marks to writing. If two question comes, probably you can consider six to eight marks, not a high priority module. Uh, how you are evaluated? Pearson says form will be two marks, means if you write between five to 75 words, you will get two out of two. Content is two, grammar is two, vocabulary is two, don't worry all these things. I'll show you a simple method. In fact, four simple methods. Just follow any one of those. You will get full marks for the content, grammar, vocabulary, form and everything. Let's talk about the strategy number one, which you've been telling since ages. Simple strategy. Copy paste two full random sentence. Sentence of your choice. It need not be logically correct. Don't put your brain and think, oh, this is logically wrong. No, software will not know that. Any two random sentences, copy paste. Full, not half, not half, not half, full. Add a connector, any connector like fanboys for and nor but or it so. Add and. In between, add a full stop in the end. That's the first technique. Second, we will show what it is, how to write. Second is start the sentence with the subordinate conjunction called since. Since copy the entire sentence, not half sentence or starting from half, no, after a full stop till you find a full stop. Copy the entire sentence and then add a comma. Copy the entire second full sentence, add a full stop. Since one full sentence, comma, another full sentence, full stop. Grammatically, they'll be perfect. Logically, they don't have to mean anything to the software. All it wants is the grammar to be perfect. That's it. Important content, nothing is there. It's a computer. It will not understand. What you have to do is apply the strategies that I'm telling you. Any one of these, this or this. This you can take number one. You can take or number two or number three or number four. Number three, let's get into three sentences. Copy paste three full sentences. Let's say the length of the passage is very long. You get three small full sentences. Add a connector and in between the first two sentences. Add a connector in between second and third sentences. Add a full stop. We'll show what it is. First sentence, connector. Second sentence, connector. Third sentence. And a full stop. The fourth one. Start the sentence with the word since, like the second strategy. We will show what they are. Add a comma. 
add the second full sentence since one full sentence comma second sentence add a connector add the third sentence full stop pay more attention the first and the third are together the first technique is between two sentence third technique is between three sentence second and the fourth strategy are the same second strategy is between two sentence third is between three sentence say two or three sentence up to you you can use it some people complain there are only small small sentences if i choose two sentences it is not even going about 25 what should i do use the third or the fourth strategy where you get to copy three sentences now i'm going to show you how to do the strategy number one but before that let's say this is the paragraph randomly you can choose to don't have to read this is of let's say 13 14 words and this is of some same 15 16 words overall this would be around 40 to 45 words two full sentence pay more attention i'm not copying half people start with this sides and tail it is usually mixed don't copy from half grammar wrong zero marks it would be straight away and don't try to write synonyms people end up writing synonyms because vocabulary marks hello you write synonyms software will not know what you write because it has knowledge of only this your reading marks will go down if you write synonyms don't write just copy paste two full sentences have taken preferably after a full stop i'm copy pasting after a full stop i'm copy pasting and if there is a question mark don't copy apart from that anything else you can copy two full sentence done now let's talk about the first strategy the strategy number one copy paste two full sentence first sentence second sentence add a comma comma and a connector in between comma and a connector add a full stop do you need 10 minutes for this hey finish it in one minute and go to next question man don't uh, have to worry about all these things this is the strategy number one well if you're bored of this doing this then come to the strategy number two same thing start the sentence with the word since comma is not required very sorry it's a mistake since copy the entire full sentence porcupines have soft hair but on their neck and it is tail is usually mixed with sharp quills add a comma there was a full stop remember after first sentence remove that add a comma copy the entire second full sentence and add a full stop in the end that's all the second strategy is all about hope you are getting it hope you are getting it hope you are getting it you can use this or you can use the first one but even after doing this if the word length is very less then you can take up the third one third one is very simple copy paste three full sentence sentence number one sentence number two sentence number three i've got three sentences one highlighted in yellow other highlighted in i don't know what color is this and the third highlighted without highlight correct without a highlight so these three have been taken into consideration three random full sentence not half add a comma and connected in between the first two sentence this is the first sentence this is the second sentence in between i'm adding comma and a connector add a comma and connector in between the second and the third sentence this is a comma and a connector in between second and the third sentence comma will come first and then the connector will come add a full stop anything you use grammar wise this is precise don't have to go to third party applications and check it will give full marks but even if it gives zero please follow this because pearson is not using those third party applications keep this in mind all right the fourth one very simple there's a typing mistake here there is no comma after since very sorry start the sentence with the sense copy the entire one full sentence in the yellow i copied the entire one full sentence add a comma when you use the word since no connector will come for the first sentence remember exactly do it you'll get marks use your own uh, albert einstein brain it will not come hope you are getting it just a comma no connector just a comma because this doesn't need a connector since doesn't need a connector if there is no since then use a connector if there is no since use a connector if there is a since you add a connector gone case just a comma copy the second entire full sentence copy the entire full sentence now this entire thing became one sentence now add a comma and a connector add the third sentence add a full stop in the end revise the video if you want more detail about this some people may have got confused because i st straightforwardly explained four different strategies any one of them you use whichever you want you use if there are two right you know summarized in text you can use the strategy number one and strategy two or one and four or two or three or one and one two and two three and three four and four 
anything in any combination you can use it will work it will give a good mark but don't mess up the strategy exactly do it grammar wise this is perfect apart from this there cannot be any other possibility some people use furthermore moreover they are not connectors they are introductory adverbs check them in the internet you have to put a semicolon and use them avoid using semicolon you can still use but since i have told one full stop one sentence semicolon probably may term it as an end of a sentence i don't suggest this but yes using this semicolon also you will get marks but i don't suggest follow my any of this four different ways of doing it you will get full marks from summarized written text towards your reading and writing all right any doubts do leave a comment in the comment section um, and if you like the video leave your appreciation with a thumbs up with this i'll park it here this is nakul signing off from skills pt soon i will be back till then take care bye bye thanks much